Aloha, Scott Sullivan Bell coming live from Sacramento, California, April 17th, 2017. Today is tax day here in the United States, 709 at night, perfect day. And I want to talk to you about something that I see consistently, and I get asked a lot, Scott, what are good movies on sales, or what are good movies for sales training? First off, I want to let you know that most movies are fiction, or most movies are adapted so that they can make a movie and make it interesting, okay? So, I don't watch Top Gun and go, you know, I could be a fighter pilot, right? I don't know. I don't watch Inception and go, you know, I could probably be a psychologist. I don't watch Talladega Nights and go, hey, guess what? I watched Talladega Nights and now I can drive a race car. That's not how it works. Now, there's some really good movies that are very interesting to watch about sales, but not necessarily sales training. So let's go through a list. We got Jerry Maguire. The cool thing you can learn from that is there's somebody that you work with that is willing to stab you in the back and steal your deal. Yep, it'll happen. Tommy Boy. Everybody has that realization in sales if they stick in long enough where they learn how like, oh my goodness, this is how it works. And they have the aha moment. Tommy had it in the diner after he got smacked in the face with a two by four, right? Great movie. Uh, the Goods, talking about car dealerships. Uh, Wolf of Wall Street about Jordan Bel Belfort. There's some cool stuff in here, but not necessarily sales training. A lot of stuff he did got him in a lot of trouble and he did some time at Club Fed. Boiler Room. Everybody loves the speech from Ben Affleck when he walks in the room, throws the Ferrari keys on the table and says, you know, if money can't buy happiness, look at the smile on my face. Wall Street, great movie from the 80s, talking about greed, greed is good, right? Not necessarily the right thing. Glenn Gary, Glenn Ross. Now that is a cool movie on sales, but it is not sales training. It's not. And the whole thing about always be closing, remember, Glenn Gary, Glenn Ross was made in the mid 80s. Right? It was made in the mid-80s. There's just a lot of stuff that we don't have that we don't use in the mid-80s anymore. Always be closing can get you in trouble. And <laughs> it's like 30 years old. Come on, it's 30 years old. I can tell you something from riding with salespeople for the last six, seven, going on, going on seven years every single day. The guys who are using always be closing struggle with it because it puts them in a weak position. I will definitely shoot you a video on that to make sense. But today we're talking about movies and how movies are not sales training they're fiction they're meant for you to, to be like entertained so stop using them for sales training sure there's ports there's sections that you could use and say hey look here's something that i see that i see salespeople struggle with but the whole movie is not sales training okay now if you could do a small favor for me in the box down below leave a comment question or story that'd be fantastic two for the money is a good one that, that's a good one too so if you if you could just put down in this box what's your favorite movie about sales what is it that would be cool to the right or to the left there is a subscribe button you know what you got to do, you got to subscribe. And then last of all, you can send it out to all your friends via StumbleUpon, Facebook, Twitter, Google+. Why not even LinkedIn? Scott Sullivan Bell. We'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Aloha.